Kitchen. Thanks for joining us. I'm Natalie Pascarella. And I'm Stephen Holt. Good afternoon. Thank you for joining us. Ghislaine Maxwell, a major player in the Epstein abuse allegations, accused of helping facilitate his alleged sex trafficking operation, and even participating in the abuse herself. Well, today, the FBI tracked her down in New Hampshire. Let's go to our chief investigative reporter, Jonathan Deans, in the newsroom. John, you broke this story. Uh, what new information do you have for us? Well, socialite Ghislaine Maxwell was arrested by the FBI around 8.30 this morning. She'd been hiding out in a 150-acre estate, apparently paid for with a million in cash. Victims were waiting for this day, the arrest of a woman who allegedly helped millionaire pedophile Jeffrey Epstein sexually abuse girls as young as 14. Ghislaine Maxwell, Epstein's one-time girlfriend and now accused sex trafficker, was put in handcuffs, the FBI taking her into custody at this New Hampshire estate. The FBI New York director calling her a, quote, villain. And more recently, we learned she had slithered away to a gorgeous property in New Hampshire, continuing to live a life of privilege while her victims live with the trauma inflicted upon them years ago. Prosecutors say not only did Maxwell recruit young girls for Epstein, but she actually took part in sexually abusing the teens. They say the abuse took place in Epstein's Upper East Side townhouse, his Florida estate, and his ranch in New Mexico. Epstein was charged one year ago with sexually abusing girls from 2002 to 2005. They say Maxwell was involved even earlier. This case against Ghislaine Maxwell is the prequel to the earlier case that we brought against Jeffrey Epstein. Epstein, a financier turned pedophile, killed himself last August inside the MCC jail in Lower Manhattan. He was awaiting trial on the sex trafficking charges. Maxwell, the daughter of a British newspaper magnate, has long denied any involvement. But today she faces a six count indictment charging her with child sex trafficking counts, alleging she was sometimes in the room joining Epstein in the sex abuse of three different underage girls. She is also charged with perjury for allegedly lying under oath in a lawsuit filed by one victim. Victims have long alleged there were others, including Maxwell, who helped Epstein recruit and sexually abuse them. So I follow Keelan up the stairs, and there's this man laying naked on a green massage table. The Epstein case shook the world of finance and even British royalty. Prince Andrew has been accused by one alleged victim of wrongdoing, allegations he denies. But federal prosecutors say to date, the prince has not agreed to answer any questions. As for Maxwell, if she's held on bail, she could wind up back in New York awaiting trial inside the same jail where Epstein killed himself. And prosecutors are asking her to be held without bail, citing her having 20 million in various bank accounts. They also say she has three passports and is using aliases like GMAX. But the FBI says they knew she was in New Hampshire, just waiting for the indictment to make the arrest. In the newsroom, Jonathan Deanst, News 4.